Hi, good morning, boys and girls. This is Miss Irene from Call Your Kids Read down at Headquarters Library. And today we are going to the zoo. We're gonna have so much fun. You know what kind of animals are at the zoo? We've got alligators and monkeys and snakes and penguins and lions. We're gonna have so much fun today. But today we're gonna start out with a song that goes to the wheels on the bus, but it's about going to the zoo. Are you guys ready? I want you to get some lions out. The lions at the zoo go roar, 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 roar. Yes, those lions at the zoo go roar, roar, roar all through the day. Now we're gonna get our snakes out. You guys ready? The snakes at the zoo go hiss, The, the snakes at the zoo go hiss, hiss, hiss all through the day. And those crazy monkeys at the zoo go ee, 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 Yes, those monkeys at the zoo go ee, all through the day. And the penguins at the zoo go waddle, 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 waddle. Waddle, waddle, waddle. Yes, those penguins at the zoo go waddle, waddle, waddle all through the day. Yay! Good job, boys and girls. Thank you for singing with me. Now, I brought a friend from the zoo with me today. His name is Mr. Alligator. Have any of you guys ever seen an alligator here in Florida? Woohoo! They are fun. Well, this is a rhyme about five little monkeys teasing him. Are you ready? Five little monkeys swinging from a tree, teasing Mr. Alligator, can't catch me. Along comes Mr. Alligator, quiet as can be, and chop, oh, chop that monkey right out of that tree. Four little monkeys swinging from a tree, teasing Mr. Alligator, can't catch me. Along comes Mr. Alligator, quiet as can be, and chop that monkey right out of that tree. We got three left. Three little monkeys swinging from a tree. Teasing Mr. Alligator, can't catch me. Along comes Mr. Alligator, quiet as can be, and chop <gasps> that monkey right out of that tree. We only have two alligator. We've got two little monkeys left. Let's see what happens. Two little monkeys swinging from a tree. Teasing Mr. Alligator, can't catch me. Along comes Mr. Alligator, quiet as can be, and jump <gasps> that monkey right out of that tree. One left, one little monkey swinging from the tree. Teasing Mr. Alligator, can't catch me. Along comes Mr. Alligator, quiet as can be, and jump that monkey right out of that tree. <gasps> Mr. Alligator, that wasn't very nice. You ate all the monkeys, but I was really hungry. Oh my goodness. Well, we're gonna have to put you away. Everybody say bye, Mr. Alligator. We have some good books to read today. The first one is from Simon and Schuster and it's called Dear Zoo. I wrote to the zoo to send me a pet and they sent me a elephant. He was too big, so I sent him back. So they sent me a, can you guys guess what this one is? A giraffe, but he was too tall, so we sent him back. So they sent me a lion. Oh my goodness, a lion as a pet, but he was too fierce, so I sent him back. So they sent me a grumpy llama. Let's look at the llama. Oh, he was so grumpy. So I had to send the grumpy llama back. So they sent me, uh-oh, a snake. Oh my goodness, who wants a pet snake? He was too, too scary. So we definitely sent him back. So they sent me a monkey. A monkey sounds like a good pet, but you know what? He was naughty. He was way too naughty. So I had to send him back. So they sent me a frog. Ooh, a frog sounds like a good pet, but he was too jumpy. So I had to send him back. So the zoo thought 
and they thought very hard and sent me a <gasps> puppy. And he was perfect and I kept him with me forever. That's our first book, Dear Zoo, a little flip book. I hope you enjoyed that one. And now we're gonna read from Harper Collins, a book about monkeys. This is called 10 Little Monkeys Jumping on the Bed. I hope you don't jump on your bed at home. 10 Little Monkeys Jumping on the Bed. Do you see all these crazy monkeys? They're jumping. Mama, one fell off and bumped his head. Oh no! Mama called the doctor and the doctor said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. Uh-oh, let's see what happens now. Nine little monkeys racing out the door. One monkey tripped and landed on the floor. Mama called the doctor and the doctor said, no more monkeys racing to the door. These monkeys are crazy. Eight little monkeys skating in the street. One monkey slipped and plopped on her seat. Oh no! Mama called the doctor and he didn't miss a beat. No more monkeys skating in the street. So don't be skating in the street either. Seven little monkeys climbing up a tree. One tumbled out and skinned his knee. Oh no, he's got a sore knee. Mama called the doctor and he said, can we agree no more monkeys climbing up a tree? Wow, there is a lot of monkeys. Six little monkeys rolling down a hill. One hit a bump and took a big spill. Oh no! Mama called the doctor and the doctor sounded ill. No more monkeys rolling down the hill. Five little monkeys hiking down the trail. One monkey flipped and bent his tail. Ow, I bet that hurt. Mama called the doctor and the doctor wailed, no more monkeys hiking down the trail. These monkeys can't do anything without getting hurt. Four little monkeys fishing off the dock. One topped in to everybody's shock. Mama called the doctor and the doctor squawked, no more monkeys fishing off the dock. There's a lot of monkeys who've gotten hurt. We're down to three little monkeys. Three little monkeys playing hide and seek. One tipped over and started to shriek. Mama called the doctor and the doctor almost couldn't speak. No more monkeys playing hide and seek. Oh my goodness. Two little monkeys dressing up in clothes, tripped wearing heels and stubbed their toes. Mama called the doctor, and what do you suppose? No more monkeys dressing up in clothes. We've got one little monkey following a map, didn't see the net, and fell into a trap. Mama called the doctor, and the doctor snapped. Put those monkeys down for a nap. Ten little monkeys jumping on the bed. Oh, no, it's starting all over again. I hope you enjoyed our books today about our zoo animals, and I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. Don't forget to take our survey online, and also remember we have lots of great ebooks online too. See you later.